So here is the Nova Umiao staple, the Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu black belt, Juicier Formiga, known, of course, as a Jiu-Jitsu guy, tremendous back taker, but the striking has really improved leaps and bounds since he stepped foot inside this octagon, Joe. Still a developing striker. We'll see how it goes for Formiga here tonight. This guy has one of the best abilities to take a shot that I have ever seen in all my years of commentating on fights. His chin is truly world class. So here he is, the founder of Jeet Kune Do, and the man Dana White calls the father of modern mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is making the walk tonight. This is perhaps the most influential martial artist of all time. Great combination of speed and power, and the power is really set up by his precision, his dynamic striking style, his timing. Bruce Lee was quoted as saying, the best fighter is someone who can adapt to any style. No one has been more adaptable than this man, Lee. This guy has the ability to take shots that would put other fighters out, absorb the punishment, and just with sheer toughness, come back from the brink of defeat and achieve victory. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. So these fighters relatively close in age, just a year apart, with similar height and some differences in reach. All right, now for the particulars, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out arena in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a jiu-jitsu fighter, holding a professional record of 22 wins, five losses. He stands five feet five inches tall, weighing in at 125 pounds. Fighting out of the top, Brazil, Juicy A. And now to the opponent, fighting at the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting at Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee. Okay, guys, protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back. All right, to here we go. I am fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming, and they're finally going to get after it. You ready? You ready? Well, good to be back in Rio as we get underway here at the Jeunesse Arena, right in the home of Rio de Janeiro. Back to his patented kicks here, but just out of range. There he goes, turning side kick. Lee going for the leg kick, he misses. Oh, counters with an overhand left, he stuck that one. Lee's strike there is blocked. Nice job by the defense. it flush so let's see if he changes up his footwork a little bit and tries to avoid further damage to the midsection moving forward nice punch by Lee. he lands an excellent combination both guys just trying to figure each other out now oh going to the head kick now it's there tagged him Oh, 
blocks the strike. Lee gets hit with a kick. He appears largely unfazed, but he doesn't want to take too many more of those, Joe. When a southpaw fighter is facing the orthodox fighter, it opens up the back left kick for the southpaw fighter, which lands on the liver. It's a very vulnerable area. And oh, he is hurt. Oh, look at this. Who saw that? Under three minutes now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. Midway through round one. Body kick, look at that. Just out of range with that right hand. That one hurt. And that one certainly found the target. Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. Oh, a huge block there. And he lands it. A huge kick for the knockout victory. Oh, absolutely one for the highlight reel right there. A tremendous kick to spell the end of the night for his opponent and for him, I should say, but just caught him flush, full force, beautiful extension on the kick, and the fight was really over as soon as that one made contact. I'm not even sure he was conscious when he hit the canvas. Outstanding performance here tonight. Let's see it one more time. And there he is after a massive knockout here tonight. Near perfect execution and a seminal moment for him here in the Octagon tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, one second of the very first round. We're playing the winner by knockout, Ruth Contreras. So the legend Bruce Lee does it again. That was a prime performance out of the martial arts legend tonight. This man, of course, has had no shortage of challengers since...